Okay, in this video I am going to show you how to uh, select pictures for your WordPress blog header and how to upload pictures to your header. And you'll see what I mean by that in a second. Okay, so you sign into WordPress, it'll take you to your main page. And this is my main page, so go to... You don't have to click on that. That was a mistake. Uh, so if you just hover your mouse over your main page title over here to the left, click on dashboard. Then you, this is how you close that, right? Okay. So I think headers is under appearance. So you go under appearance, click the little arrow over here to the right. This drops down, click on header. And here is your custom header page. So as you can see, here are my uploaded images. And you can select one image to be static. Um, or you can click on random. And then every time you change pages, a new picture, a new header picture will show up, but that's another video. So you can choose one of these default images that are loaded up on WordPress for you, and you can do the same thing. They can, if you click random, they're going to, every time you click onto a new page on your, um, when somebody is looking at your blog and they switch pages, like if you have multiple pages, they go back and forth, there's going to be, a, these pictures are going to randomly show up as the header, or you can just pick that one. Um, to be static at your header all the time for all your pages. And again, you can you can have you can pick these to be static. You can have this one to be your your static picture on your main page. This one on your you know another page. This with this one static on another page, and so on. But that's another tutorial. So this is I choose random and have these pictures show up at different times randomly. Um, so to upload, to choose a picture that you want to crop and upload to your image bank here, click choose, go to your folder, and choose your picture, and then hit upload, and then this page will show up. And depending on the size of the picture, this picture, for instance, in the exam my example here, is only this big. But if it were a, a larger picture, it would show up larger here. And you'll, you can experiment with that, but this is just the... Then you can drag this down. You can adjust this. You can make it smaller, and it proportionally goes smaller, the cropping part. Um, you can adjust it up and down like this, but that's it. So you hit Crop and Publish. And as you can see, it's added to my, um, my picture bank here. And it selects it automatically. So now this is selected to be my my static picture and if I go to my main page that's gonna be it. So this is how somebody will view this page and this is gonna be the static picture there all the time. So now to remove this you go back to your dashboard and now you go to I believe it's media library and here all your are all your pictures um, that you that I've uploaded uploaded. So now I just select the one I want to delete, click delete permanently and hit OK. And that's it. Now I go back to my header page and see it defaulted to this random down here. That's why this picture is selected. But now I am going to click random on the pictures that I want. And you have to go down and hit save right here to make to save your changes. And now I'm back to the pictures that I want to randomly be chosen. Now this is what I mean by, um, or what the random button means. So there's my home page and then there's my about page. These are the, and, and see here we go, it's randomly selected. This picture is randomly selected. Now if I go back to my home page, another picture is going to be selected. If I go back to my About page, was this the same one? I don't know. Let's see. Oh, okay, so that's 
a new picture. That's a new picture. See what I mean? Um, and that's how you um, upload pictures and select pictures for your header.